Hi, everyone. How is everybody today? This is our second week of our holiday traditions that center around light. And last week we learned about the Hindu holiday of Diwali, which is the festival of lights. And there we made a little candle holder. Well, today we're going to read a story called this is the star by Joyce Dunbar and it's about a different kind of light. It's not the candle light or like our lights that we use in our house, but this is a special light that lets us see outside at nighttime and that's stars. And so let's find out what this story is about. A star? Hmm. Okay. This is the star. This is the star in the sky. These are the shepherds watching by night. That saw the star in the sky. And shepherd is a name of people who take care of sheep. This is the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. And here's the shepherds. This is the donkey with precious load, trudging the long and weary road, looked on by the angel shining bright, who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. This is the inn where the only room was a stable out in the lamplit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road, looked on by the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. This is the ox and this is the ass who saw such wonders come to pass at the darkened inn where the only room was a stable out in the lamp lit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road looked on by the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. This is the manger warm with hay, wherein a newborn baby lay. This is the ox and this is the ass who saw the wonders come to pass at the darkened inn where the only room was a stable out in the lamplit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road, looked on by the young angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. This is the gold and the fragrant myrrh and frankincense, the gifts that were placed by the angel manger warm with hay, wherein the newborn baby lay. And this is the ox and this is the ass who saw the wonders come to pass at the darkened inn where the only room was a stable out in the lamplit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road looked on by the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky. These are the wise men come from afar who also saw and followed that star, bearing the gold and fragrant myrrh and frankincense, the gifts that were placed by the name manger warm with hay, wherein the newborn baby lay. This is the ox and this is the ass who saw the wonders come to pass at the darkened inn where the only room was a stable out in the lamplit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road, looked on by the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night.
that saw the star in the sky. This is a child that was born. This is the Christ child born to be king while hosts of heavenly angels sing. And these are the wise men come from afar who also saw and followed the star bearing the gold and fragrant myrrh and frankincense, the gifts that were placed by the manger warm with hay wherein the newborn baby lay. And this is the ox and this is the ass who saw these wonders come to pass as the darkened inn where the only room was a stable out in the limp, limp sorry, lamp lit gloom for the donkey and his precious load who trudged the long and weary road, looked on by the angel shining bright who came to the shepherds watching by night that saw the star in the sky and still shines the star in the sky. The end. So an inn is another name for like a hotel and they were riding a donkey. Nowadays, remember this took place thousands of years ago, a long, long time ago. So the people wore different clothes and they didn't have cars yet. So they had to ride a donkey or horses or camels. And we ride cars and trucks. So you can imagine how long it took them to go anywhere if they had to ride on the back of an animal. Hmm, how long would it take you to get to the store? Anyway, on some night, you might want to go out and look at the stars as they shine in the sky for you.